Making sure that your cat has the correct body condition score is one of the most significant things that you can do to ensure that he or she stays healthy and lives a long and full life. The first part of this is to know how to measure body condition score accurately. Though ultimately you are making a comparison to the diagram, it is essential to lay your hands on your cat and have a good feel of its body. Start with the head. Danny here has a body condition score 3 to 4, a little bit tubby. Look at how round your cat's head is. The larger and rounder the head, generally the higher the body condition score. Next, feel under the chin, around the neck and over the shoulders. Feel for loose tissue. Fatter cats tend to accumulate loose folds of tissue here. Then turn your attention to their body. From above, you should be able to see an hourglass figure with a nicely obvious waist. As you run your hands over their chest, you should be able to feel the ridges of their ribs without pressing hard. Danny is not very keen to stand up for us here, but you should pass your hands underneath their tummy, feeling for fatty folds. Once you are happy that you have had a thorough examination, take a look at the sliding scale diagram and choose the cat physique that most closely matches. Remember to do this as accurately as possible. Knowing your cat's body condition score will make a difference. It has been statistically proven that cats with a body condition score of three live significantly longer and healthier lives. Mm -hmm.